Thank you, Nashville. You guys have been a great host. We've really enjoyed our time here. Uh, congratulations to David Poyle. Uh, great career managing. You know, someone who's been great to me and uh, helped mentor me and through along my first year. Um, I'd also like to congratulate Vegas, Golden Knights on the Cup win, George McPhee and Kelly McCrimmon. And I'd like to say hello and thank you to our fans watching around the world and at the SAP Center tonight. Our <laughs> to make our pick is Sharks legend, NHL all-time games played leader, Patrick Marlowe. With the fourth selection overall, the San Jose Sharks are proud to select Will Smith from the USA Development Program. And there it is, the first American selected. In fact, it's the fifth straight year someone from the U.S. National Team Development Program has been selected in the top five. They're doing a great job of getting uh, people into the NHL, and the latest addition is Will Smith. He was ranked 17th way back in October, a meteoric rise. How did that happen? How did it happen? He played on the best line in amateur hockey, along with uh, teammates Ryan Leonard and Gabe Perot. He was the driving force behind that line, down the middle of the ice. This guy plays with such speed and such passion. He's a dual threat guy. He can shoot it from distance. He can work from in tight, but also has great distribution ability and has the kind of confidence in his game. He's not afraid to try and mostly execute risky plays. This guy wears number two, though. I've said, dude, what are you doing wearing number two? He says, ah, you know what? I grew up in Boston area, Brian Leach. I got to watch him play a little bit. He was one of my favorite players. I'm going to go with number two plus. Hey, it's a little bit different for a forward. So give him credit for jumping outside of the box a little bit there. But Will Smith, a fantastic year all the way around. His 51 goals, 127 points through mixed competition against the USHL, against college, internationally, against the toughest teams in the world, at the end of teens, the five nations, all through the time putting up 127 points. Impressive stuff from Will Smith. Well said, Sammy. I don't know if I can really double down on it, but the reality is all offense from this kid, okay? He's a motion player. What I mean by that is he doesn't stop on the play often enough for the pro game. He gets away with it here at the U.S. National Team Development Program and amongst his peer group. But as he matures, he's not going to be able to blow the defensive zone looking for loose pucks in the neutral zone to go on offense all the time. He's going to have to stop and start more. His spatial aware awareness defending in his zone is going to have to be more engaged just more engaged all i need him to do is be average defensively because the skill set is elite let me ask you this though when you play with two guys who are as elite as leonard and perot the opportunity to cheat the game a little bit because you have that great chemistry would that present maybe some of the cheat in his game because he's got such great chemistry with the line mates yeah potentially but you're still gonna have to break that habit as he matures so there he is will smith uh again taken fourth overall you guys just mentioned these eye-pop numbers right like the unbelievable not just the 50 goal score but you put up 127 points everywhere I read everything I saw it just said elite playmakers that's a fair assessment it's absolutely 100% accurate and and I don't want to double down on getting ahead of the play but you're seeing these clips and see how far ahead of the play he is when he gets the puck but hey listen when he gets it look what happens it's in the back of the net I mean it's a no doubter okay he is, you know, just an elite player. Taking and some some pictures here of, uh, of the kids that he's been growing up with. Well, here's ahead, an interesting DA. one because it was Mike Greer who made the pick, but maybe oh, it was yeah. Jaden uh, Greer who actually had the inside uh, word because that's Mike Greer's son with him there. Uh, Chuck, did you get a lot of influence with family leaning in when you're making picks on the floor? <laughs> <laughs> I wish we could have with a guy like this. This is, <laughs> this is what every team wants right here. What a, what a gifted player. And the defensive part of the game will come. We're pretty good in the NHL at having coaches teach how to play defense. You had to think that a Boston area guy was going to be picked there by San Jose. There were two players. I think Ryan Leonard wouldn't have been one of them. His brother John was selected by San Jose a few years back. Played some games in Nashville this year. But also Will Smith, the Boston area guy. Sometimes when you get that inside knowledge and you've grown up, you, you, you feel more confident about the pick. All right, four picks, four centers, and again, some talented players, and he joins elite company, most career points on the U.S. national team. Only Jack Hughes with a greater uh, couple of years than Will Smith.